Welcome to the Visa Halftime. Those of you watching St. Louis and Atlanta, if you like offensive football, you've got plenty of it. 29-21 to score at the half. Howie and Chris over here laughing because they've been watching this game and they love this guy, Kurt Warner. But I love NFL history. And this is a little piece of history for all our viewers. This is Derek Vaughn. He will take the opening kickoff 96 yards for a touchdown. Well, that's not NFL history, but this is the opening kickoff return for a touchdown. And then the ensuing kickoff returned by Tony Horn. This one covering 103 yards for a touchdown. Both touchdowns were set up up the middle and then break right or left. Beautiful job with tied at Seminole. And then Warner back. Three receivers to the right. They scatter like well. Tony Horn in the back of the end zone. Three-yard touchdown inception. And then because kicker Jeff Wilkins injured his quad, the holder Keith Lyle flips it to London Fletcher. Two-point conversion is good. And then Jamal Anderson for four yards out. He had rushed for 60 yards on this drive. And then we're tied at 21 all. And then here comes the pump fake left. And then Ozzie Akeem inside move back to the outside. 30-yard 30 30 yard reception and run. Touchdown. Two-point conversion and good. And a wild one. Rams 29-21 over the Falcons. Ricky Williams, 34. Texan, there you are. Ricky Williams out of the eye. Over to the right side. Bulls his way in from two yards out. 7-0 Saints. Williams will have 90 yards rushing in the first half of this game. Now, Panthers driving Burline passing in for Donald Hayes, but there is cornerback Kevin Mathis. He picks it off interception. Saints awfully impressive in this football game, especially defensively. 10-6 over the Panthers. Aikman, last three visits up to New York. Five interceptions. First play of the game, deep for the Rocket. Jason Seahorn, interception, injured his shoulder, has not returned in this football game. Now, Aikman back again, firing to the rocket, intercepted this time by Sean Williams. Aikman will have four interceptions in the first half. Now, after a catch by Ike here, down to the one-yard line, play action, bootleg. Williams out, linebackers come up, drop it behind to the tight end, Pete Mitchell. Giants 7-0 over the Cowboys. Baltimore's number one ranked rushing defense is limited. Stephen Davis is just two rushing yards, all tied at three. That in the third period of play there. Sebastian Janikowski for Oakland has missed two more field goals. He's now 6-13 on the season. Kansas City 9-1 against Oakland at home. They're on top in that contest. Bills and charges. Rob Johnson at the helm, 7 of 11, 77 yards. He's gotten the Bills to a four-point lead over the Tigers right now. And Kent Graham back at the helm for the Steelers. Guiding them to a 10 0 lead over Chris's Bengals. Atlanta and St. Louis. You were thinking maybe just keep the kicker out for St. Louis and let him play. Yeah, well, I have a kicker on that team. It just slows down the offense. But on the, on the other side of the ball, you've got an Atlanta offense that came into this game without an offensive touchdown for eight quarters. And then they go up against the St. Louis defense, and all of a sudden they're getting this thing pieced together. I say thank goodness for St. Louis's defense because it's fun to watch them. You know, if their defense was good, then Kurt Warner would be on the bench, Marshall Park would be on. Otherwise, now we get to watch them go for the whole second half. Yeah. And poor Dan Marino, all his records are going to be gone. <laughs> it's going to be a rough week at HBO. <laughs> you know, you know, everyone wants to wants the Rams offense. Everybody wants to be like the Rams offense. It's simple. All you got to do is schedule the Rams defense. They are on pace right now for 450 yards. This Atlanta offense, it is really a struggle right now for that defense to put anything together. They thought a week off would help, maybe some substitutions. They need to get some people healthy. It's a question mark. How many games can this offense go like this? I, when are they going to hit a bump in the road? They love it. I don't think it'll stop one bit. And, and really, I think Atlanta's played awfully well, and especially in the first quarter. They really got after Warner, really had him off his rhythm. It may take them a quarter, quarter and a half to get going. But, yeah, they and they've got done it. They got him good. They only got I'm 29 trying to the hold the viewers, man. Leave it alone, will you? <laughs> <laughs> the worst of my losing thing Break in the beginning. 8.8 .8 have been the previous.